Hi, it's Jenny at the Jenny Kite Group here at Remax Patriots. And I wanted to take a minute and talk about multi-generational homes. First off, we have had several individuals asking about, are there any multi-generational homes available? Or are there homes that could be converted into a multi-generational home? Well, the answer to both of those questions is yes and yes. A couple things to consider though. First of all is, have you ever had the opportunity to live in a multi-generational home? And what are your goals and driving factors to having a multi-generational home? I have actually had two experiences with a multi-generational home. First off, when I was a child, I had two grandparents and they actually had, one had an in-law quarters and another one we converted um, part of the garage into an apartment for my grandfather. So my grandmother and my grandfather both had different living areas in addition to our family component as a child. It was a really nice opportunity to get to know my grandparents in ways that you wouldn't know them otherwise unless you lived with them. The other aspect that I had with a multi-generational home was um, when my son was younger, my grandmother moved in with my husband and child and myself. And that was really a nice opportunity to have my son get to know his grandmother, or actually, his great-grandmother um, when he was younger. Now, there are definitely aspects that can be positive and there are definitely aspects that can be not so positive, which that's just your family dynamics and making sure you set boundaries of what's acceptable and what's not acceptable at the very beginning. Um, and then from there, having maybe monthly meetings on how things are going, um, but one of the things that when people ask, is it possible to convert a home into a multi-generational home, some considerations are, does the township or borough allow for additional homes or does the township or borough allow for additional building components of your current home. Um, we've actually had buyers ask if they can build a separate building for their mother or grandfather or whatnot. And it's really depending upon the zoning ordinance and if there's any special exceptions, which only the township or borough or municipality can tell you that. There are also, if you're going to go and add on to your current home and make an addition, you need to make sure you obtain building permits as well because it very well could be that later you're asked to remove that addition that was built on if you didn't obtain the correct permits and planning documents that you do need. So, from a family component, multi-generational homes can be amazing and really add value um, because you just don't really know people unless you live with them sometimes. Um, so that's in a good way and eh, maybe not such a good way. But um, family's family um, and when it comes down to it, it's always great to know your family and enjoy the time that you have together. Have a wonderful day.